So too, your audio is poor today. Yeah, it shouldn't be poor today, Charles. Wow. Hurry up and sort it out. <laughs> wow. What is happening? What is happening to our audio today? We plan to have fun, but both is bad. Even mine is bad. Wow. Mm. <laughs> Wow, wow, wow. Okay. Okay. How is mine now? Mine is clear. Yeah, somebody's saying mine is clear, but it's low. Wow, let me see. Low. How is it now? How is my voice now? Better. That's better. Clearer. How is my voice now? <laughs> Fantastic. Okay. <laughs> okay, okay. It should not be today. My voice should be clear today. When I have my public voice, should be. <laughs> clear. <laughs> yes, so, yes, yes, yes. So we have we have we have lots of people joining us from Facebook now. I can see Jennifer, the duty, uh Ellen, the Mepo, and um uh, Shoma God Love Perotubo, Pian the Piana, Precious, Vera Francis. No, you know what you need to do, guys? Tag your team members, tag your your success lines, 
tag your friends, family members, everyone you think should see this show. Do a watch party, share, share, share. Whatever nuggets you are going to get for today's uh, webinar, just be dropping the nuggets. Take note of it. The greatest memory we have today is your pen, right? you know, your pen. So take note of whatever you're going to learn today. And so I'm going straight now. It's time. Let me introduce our powerful guest that is with us today. So uh, our name is Mrs. Amadu Titi Layomi, the star director two in Longridge, a, a 1982 graduate of the University of Ife. Check! Wow. Great affair. <laughs> Nigeria. Fellow of, I know many of us were not born there, guys. Many of us. So uh, the, let me continue. Uh, fellow of the Institute of Chartered Accountants of Nigeria, ICANN. You got that? ICANN. And a fellow of the Chartered Institutes of Transition of Nigeria. Member of various professional organizations, Africa Women in Leadership Organization, Society of Women Accountants of Nigeria, Society of Women Taxation in Nigeria, Global Women Association, European Women Organization, UK. She was a non executive director of First Bank Nigeria Mortgage Limited and a member of its Credit and Investment Committee. Mrs. Amadu is a member of the Eurofinance and Economics Group and speaks at the corporate treasury conferences. She is a member of the prestigious club PGW and a star director with Long Beach Bioscience International. A multiple trip and car awardee. A major dividend of our Long Beach investment is our NGO called Women's Organization of Resources, Knowledge, and Skills. Box, box, where she helps women Works. every <laughs> any kind of achieve their goals by training them to be leaders using the Long Beach platform. Mrs. Amadu, aka Mama Pablo, is a wife, mother, and grandmother. She enjoys, she enjoys dancing, cooking, and singing. You know, the first time I met her, I see a woman who is so positive, passionate, doing a business. And I'm always excited when I see people of her category doing, doing this business because many people thought our business uh, is meant for those who have nothing to do, who are jobless. And you are seeing someone with this high profile in this business, guys. I hope you can hear me, guys. Anybody you yes, yes, yes. having this feeling of mentality, tag them on this webinar today. And let's hear from our boss lady, Mama Pablo. You're welcome. Ma. Thank you very much, my SD. Thanks for having me. <laughs> uh, I'm so excited. Um, I'm super, super excited. You are excited, guys, to, to hear from our mama. I want you to drop one, one, one in the chat box. Put in the energy, put in the emoji. You know, it's, it's, it's rare for us to see calibers of people like this uh, joining our business and going all out. And I, I'm always excited seeing people like this doing their business. So we want to hear from you, ma. How come? I know it's how come you join network marketing with this batch of uh, portfolio? How come? Were you in love with network marketing before? Without mentioning the name of uh, the company, I don't know if you have joined any company before now. Without mentioning their name, okay. were you in love with it before? So what if we are not? What made you to now look into it? Let's hear from, let's hear that part first. 
Thank you very much, my esteem. I have always been a lover of network marketing. Why? I hate to be caged. I have never loved nine to five jobs. I love the lifestyle network marketing gives you. It, it helps you to think outside the box. It doesn't cage you. You share your ideas, you name your price and you go for it. I have always loved network marketing. Wow. I, before Longridge, I have been in two and I rose to be directors too. In them, I rose to be directors. I love network marketing. When did you when did you join network marketing? How long now? Um, as a hobby, I started as a hobby with network marketing because I had I had always had jobs to satisfy my husband. He liked me to you know be an executive in, in, in an office, chauffeur driven car, have a big office with staff. I have never liked that. But for him, I did it. But while doing that, I always had this network marketing in the background. So I really started like maybe 19, maybe 1990, 1980. 1987 to 90. That was when I started. Woo! Woo, guys! 1997. Well, 19, that that is that is a whole lot of time. And what 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 now what now attracted you to Longridge? What now attracted you? To? Yes, very good question. When I joined Longridge, it was accidentally. By that time, I thought I had. I was done with network marketing because I was looking at retirement. I had done two with my job and then I decided to just retire to my audit practice. Just do my audit practice and, and enjoy my life. But then my husband had an issue. He had uh, what we call that was, it was Nigeria in the UK. They gave him everything booked. And then one day I saw him swallowing something. And I took the bottle and I saw made in China. And I said, don't let's add this to it. China makes fake products. Why don't we just concentrate on what the doctors? He said, no, 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 no. He's the one that is in pain. He needed to try everything. And in two weeks, exactly, that spondylosis left him. And I'm talking 2015. Since 2015 till today, it left. So what did I do? I said, if this tablet can work like arthro and calcium, I said I needed to buy more. So I called the person who sold it to him and said I wanted more. I didn't want it to finish in the house. So got there, I was like, you want six each, six bottles each. Why don't you use it to register? I said, no, 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 no. Register. I didn't even know it was a network marketing business. I said, no, but I'm not I'm not interested in network marketing again. I've done everything. I've seen it all, I thought. And this guy said, no, it's not, the, it's not like them. I said, it is. I said, he said, you don't need to sell in this. You don't need, I said, you don't need to sell. That's a lie. There's no network marketing business that you won't need to sell. I argued, but then, because I'm, I'm a lover of people, I like, I'm a friendly person. So I just said, okay. I'll try it. And sure enough, I didn't need to sell. I didn't need to buy unless I needed. That was how I started. My husband was so surprised because I told him I, I was done. I was done with network marketing business. But that was it. I didn't need to sell and I didn't need to buy every time. I didn't need to buy every month. The other ones I had that got expired because I had to keep on buying 
to be relevant. So that's it. Wow. Uh, uh, you know, many many of us who joined this uh, uh, long bridge, many of us who joined it joined as a result of one product helping us or the other. Because when, when I joined the business, it was the product that attracted me when I had an aspect. The same factory you just mentioned. And that was what attracted me to join the business. So I, I see all, in all my interviews, it must be a product that has really assisted one person or the other. And because of that, they now take a look. Because at first, they don't, you know, it's not something you want to do. But they now take a look. So the same thing you are, you are still mentioning. And so do you mean that the product attacks? What can you say about the product? Hey, hey let's talk. Don't, don't, don't try us today. Welcome back. Hello. Hello. Yeah. Can you hear me? You can hear you. Yeah. Welcome back. Can you, you can the network, the yeah. network should not try us. Thank you. And so what 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 since, since, since the product is what attracted you to the business? What can yeah. can you talk a little about it? About the products? Yeah. I said the products are the bedrock of this business. Without the products, there's nothing really. The products are so good. And that is what we are offering. We are offering products as a solution to many, many issues. There's no one that uses our products that will not come go away with a, a testimony. What I did when I started Longridge is to go into the product. I use the product and with malaria every other, every eight weeks, I used to have malaria. I'm an AA genotype. But when I saw what the Arthro did for my husband, I started sampling. The first thing, the most consistent is my cup. When I started using the cup, it flushed out all my acid, the acid in my body, in my system. I used to have sinus, sinusitis. Since I was a baby, a, a, a toddler, I had it up till 2015, thanks to the products, long reach products, the cup, occasionally the cordyceps, occasionally. I'm not a lover of tablets, but I, I, I use my cup every time. I was, my body was so acidic, so I was always catching anything around, my immunity was low, but the cup helped me. Wow, wow, that's, that's, that's great. Also, Thank 
And the network is actually not today. Sometimes it's like that, guys. And so you can see many people who join our business today, what attracts them is the products. Products are amazing. The products are amazing. And so if you make people use the products, people will join your business, guys. People will join your business. Sometimes we, we force people to do what they don't want to do. But when you give them what they want, when you think about them first, they will surely join your business. I hope you got that part. And so what attracted that was the product. Sometimes when people, people said, I've spoken to this person, the person refused to join my business. I tell them, why don't you give the person, the, look at the, what the, ask the person, what are the challenges is going through at wise and share the catalog of our products to the person to pick up what he wants. And I tell you, once you start using the products, they might look at the business. So first turn them to customers. Turn them to customers. Drop that in the chat box. You gotta turn them to customers. Then with time, they will now become the distributors of the products. They will start driving the business. And so, let's see if we can have a sorry, guys. Sorry, we our network is acting up, so give us time. Um, Anyone here that has a great testimony about the product, you want to talk about it briefly? You have a great testimony, mind blowing, mind boggling testimony about the product on Zoom here. A Uzo or Gene. Yeah. 
want to come up and talk about it, Uzo. Did I bring you up? Okay. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, you can drop it. Drop it here so that all of us can see. Drop it in the chat box so that we can all see. Why we wait? We want to. The reason why I'm doing all this is to let you guys know that we have great personalities in our business, amazing personalities. This is not a business for ordinary people. This is not a business for people who are looking for jobs. Our profession gives you the opportunity to spend more time with your family, to put the price on the time, not you. Being afraid of what you want to buy, you give you, you can you, you are given a blank check to put whatever you want to earn in our profession. Your, your money is not tagged, the lifestyle you want is not tagged. So uh, and and the and the caliber of people we have in our business, you you, you can't you can't you cannot be quantified. So when, when we put our shows uh, webinars like this, take advantage of it. If you have people with same personality, with this kind of influence. You can share with them and let them see that they have their kind of people in our business. Somebody who has graduated from EFA since the 80s and is uh, an icon. You know what it takes to be an, to have an icon? You, you know what? Those of you who are accountants here, some of you guys struggle to have it. And she has mentored several people in our profession in our profession, not only in our profession, even in the accounting industry, the banking industry. So it is so it's a privilege to have them come share their story with us so as we us to learn from them. Uh, you're, you're welcome back now. Are you there? Hello. Uh, Welcome back. Yes, thank you very much. Can you hear me now? Yeah, we can hear you. It's like you switched position. Yes, I had to change my device. Yes, yes. Yes, can you hear me now? Yeah, we can hear you. Okay, great, great, great. Your picture is not showing. Yes, I think I should just leave it like that. My 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 Wi-Fi is playing up, so maybe I should okay. just do it's it okay. without picture, without video. The video, okay, it's yes. okay, it's it's yes. okay. And so, so is is um uh cool. Like you were talking about the products, and we have seen how yes. the products has really helped you. Yes. Uh, regain your health. Yes. And that has really be a blessing to so many of us who have joined this business. So can you tell us about your journey so far? How, how when you joined Longreach, how were you able to climb to where you are? Okay. That's a very good question because that's what we're all here for. Now, Longreach has dividends to offer. I noticed that in the beginning. These dividends are categorized into two, health dividends and 
wealth dividends, being financially free. Now, yes. as a professional, I looked for people that needed those two things. Maybe myself, I, I prefer the dividends, what could come to me. And I shared the experience, I shared it. The first thing I decided to do in sharing is to develop testimonies around myself. I know people are going to ask me, have you used it before? What has it done for you? You are offering us two things, health and wealth. What health pro uh, testimonies do you have? What wealth testimonies do you have? I made sure I had both. So I just started offering people. I've just told you about my health testimonies, including my tooth. In England, I, I, my, my, my dentist in England was going to take out two of my teeth that day. He, she said, because of my age, I should take out one and then come back for the second one. This was 2016, January. I took out one and today I still have the second one just because I was using the long grid toothpaste. I use this one to break every bone. It's harder, stronger than the other ones that have no problem. I develop testimonies around myself. I make sure that I, I won every promo. Mm. I, was, I was deliberate about that. Why? Because I'm offering these dividends. It's a showcase. I need to showcase the dividends if I need them to join me. I was very successful with the health one. I tried every, every product except Libao, that is for the male. <laughs> <laughs> I recorded every thing that happened to me. I had, I measured all my, everything I did with Long Reach, I, I was measuring. And then I would offer. And then my upline, as the show used to tell me, we need, just tell your, bring your, 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 your social capital, social capital. <laughs> <laughs> and I said, who is my social capital? They are my people, my profession, the professionals like me, the people I, 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 I go to meetings with, the board of First Bank. I remember the day I offered the opportunity at the board meeting. I just got to the board and I, I put the toothpaste on each table, each chair, or in front of every chair. And when the chairman started the meeting, I didn't say anything. I didn't say a word. I just put the toothpaste there. After the meeting, he said, any AOB? I didn't say a word. I, I was appearing to be busy. And he now said, Mrs. Amadou. I said, yes, sir. Any AOB? I said, none, sir. He said, I thought you were going to sell this to us. I said, no, sir. It's not for sale. My family and I just invested in the company that manufactures that. I just want a second opinion, sir. Do you know that the whole of First Bank, that board, the whole of the board signed on in my, in my team. Not wow. only that, they all what signed up their children. Guys, I, did you got that? <laughs> they signed up their children, their families, everyone. Eventually, Longreach and First Bank Mortgages partnered together. And today, they are still with us. They offer us mortgages. You start from yourself. I believed in that toothpaste 
I knew I had a testimony. I knew if I offered it to anybody, they would have a testimony and we have a lasting, long lasting relationship because of that. I was talking about the, there was a time I was coming from the US. I had this, um, you know, hay fever. I was, I was journey to the UK. And I felt like scratching, scratching. And I was telling myself, how will I survive this? Me, I had the mouth freshener. I didn't hear it from anywhere, but I just tried it. I sprayed a little bit on my finger and I put in the corners of my eyes. My SD, do you know that it took three days after I arrived in the UK, then I remember that I had that problem. No oh. itching in the plane, no itching. I just remembered after three days when I landed that I had what did you problem. use? What did you use? Mouth, mouth freshener. Mouth freshener. <laughs> Hey, because hey. it was the only available thing. <laughs> it was the only available thing. I didn't even know it would work. Use what is available. <laughs> yeah. You know? So I started drawing people because of my testimonies. And then I said, my first alert, my first alert was 640 Naira. And I was so disappointed. I remember going to SD Shem, I said, ah, oh, Shem, I don't think this thing is going to work. I don't think it's going to work. 640 for what? It's a time waster. How much? 640 naira. 640 naira. <laughs> but he encouraged me. He kept encouraging me. He said, mommy, don't worry. Mommy, don't worry. Let, let, you know, one thing I did was, even though I'm 20 years older than Shem, my SD, but I did all he said I should do. He, he's my mentor in this business. He mentored me yes. and I listened to him. I trained under him. And today I'm the better for it. He taught me so many things, so many, you know, younger brains. He taught me many strategies. And mm. I would, you know, he knew I would do it if he asked me to. You know, not everyone you ask to because, do things. Because you were coachable, despite your yes. level of I was a good you student. Yes, I was a good yeah. student. You know? So I did it, and today I'm the better for it. Everything he asked me to do, I tried. And wow. it was my greatest, my greatest, you know, it, it, it would just encourage me. Greatest encourager. Even when my husband was thinking, you, this woman, you are too old for all this. You want to be joining li little boys and girls going up and down. Shem will be there. My ex Shem will come and encourage my husband. And everything, the products, I kept using them and getting testimonies. And I was excited about the business, excited about the products. And then the money started coming. The alert started increasing, of course. This, but I had to go reach out. I made a list of all my people, everyone, my social capital, everyone I knew. And then I began to, to lead, help leaders. I started bringing out leaders, raising leaders, making sure I was everything my decision told me I was giving back to them. I was also sharing with them. And I was telling them to also share with their own people. We were raising leaders because I knew that with age, I will not, need, I will not be able to do this for a long time. I'm now retired, retire, retired age. But then I have leaders with me. My leaders are working. They're, and they are enjoying what they are doing because that is the culture that they met on ground. And that was the culture I met on ground, being excited, having a positive mind about everything. Scarcity of products will not stop us. Nothing will stop us. 
Crisis in the company will not stop us. We get, we focus. We focus and we break barriers because we have a strong why. We build a why on touching lives. When you know that you need to, you have brought in lives into the business. You can't abandon them. Just sorry, just because somebody is, you need to help them. Everybody needs to go on. And with that, we have been able to do what we. So I raised leaders and together my leaders and I were a great team and we're enjoying ourselves. A great dividend of the NGO, partner, partner with Longreach. My NGO and Longreach, we are partners and we, my NGO is raising women leaders, raising proper women, strong women, women that's going to have a voice, a voice in the boardroom, a voice in the nation, a voice in the home. Those are the kinds of women my NGO is, is raising. And now we have contracts from international organizations to help them raise their women to help them raise their leaders, which is fantastic. And that is retirement for me. Another thing I have been able to do in this business is to leave a legacy for my grandchildren. The Bible says a good woman, a good man, woman, leaves an inheritance for his, her children's children. By the grace of God, I have been able to do that for my grandchildren. There are long reach bonuses are going into an account that they cannot touch until they are 18. And they are both diamond four now. Hopefully they are going to be directors soon. They're only three and two, but it's a great dividend for me. It's one of, I've been able to build my own office I used to rent offices, pay heavily for spaces. But today, my long big business has built a hall that sits about 100 people and a two-story office complex where I can do whatever I like. It's all from Longreach. So with all this, it encourage when I see a little thing, when I see myself accomplishing, It gives me fuel. It what it get my lead that this is happening to me. It can happen. Better things will happen to a forty-year-old, a thirty-year-old, a twenty-year-old. We'll be able to do better than a sixty-year-old. So that's my journey so far. I'm an accomplished professional now, an accomplished wife, mother, and grandmother, and I give God the glory. This is great. This is. Mind blowing, mind blowing, guys. I, I don't know if you heard the whole part. She, 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 there's nothing like coming to an environment and humble yourself to learn what it takes for you to be in that environment. Our, our mentor is our offline, she's older than him, and she never looked at even our profile. Is still more than the upline, but still she humbled herself and learned strings what it would take for her to grow in the business. Her upline kept encouraging her even when she was discouraged. I imagine the high profile person, 640 naira. What is all this? What is all this? What kind of fun is this? But you, mm -hmm. you were patient. You kept oh, building yes, the sir. business. You got the encouragement. Yeah. You accepted. You accepted it. 
You accepted yeah. what, what your upline said and you went all out. Yeah. Man, I love that strategy. <laughs> there's there's nothing like being bold and you know confident with what you have, believing in what you have. Because if you didn't believe in what you have, you will not drop the toothpaste with those caliber of people in that meeting. You drop the toothpaste on the table. <laughs> you know, <laughs> look at the method you use in entering there. Many, many people like you just say, I can't tell my friends. I know there's no way I can tell my friends about this. Yeah. Because why? Oh. They are they are they are feeling that that's not the kind yes, of business yes. their friends should join. So at the same time, they are also afraid of rejection from their friends. How do you undo that? Wow. How were you able to face? Well, was was it that you didn't face any rejection? Ah, the, the rejection. people didn't laugh at you when you were when ah, you started the business. That's my second name, my middle name, rejection. <laughs> of course, but you know what? I knew. See, if you are sure of yourself, if you are sure of what you are doing, I had a strong why. And I went for the dividends. I focused on the on the dividends. I made sure, you see, most people who rejected me initially even came back after seeing the dividends. But uh, rejects, of course. Any you know, sometimes I I I I I made myself attractive to them. I made the business attractive by making myself attractive so mm. and you know i told you i'm a friendly person and yes, i'm very yes, yeah i'm a that. very friendly person <laughs> i love people i love people so even if i don't if if i'm going to ask you to join me in my long -lived business i'm not going to start with that i'm going to start by first being friendly with you i'll be friendly with you and get you to a point that if you are going to reject, ah, in fact, you will, you, you, you will be my, a user in my business. Not, not, you may not be a networker, but you'll be a user. Because it, it's, my, it's my lifestyle. I, I've made Long Beach a lifestyle thing. It's, it's, it's very difficult for people not to be attracted to me or to my business. I made sure of that. And I found out that rejection, of course I had rejections, but um, with time, they were becoming less and less. So, so that some people will ask, have you joined Mrs. Amadou's business? It was like an in thing in my circle. Like, mm. yeah, like it's, it's something that's, <laughs> that is trending. Oh, have you seen Mrs. Amadou? Have you joined her business? And I make sure I don't leave my prospects. I don't leave them until they are able to, to run by themselves. The first thing I let mm -hmm. you do is to earn. Once I, I structure, I made a few mistakes myself and I made sure those mistakes my my team will not repeat it one of the big mistakes i made was i concentrated on one leg my baby's leg mm. i believed that the other two people my husband and my other my first child were they should be able to run by themselves so i concentrated on my middle leg my baby's leg but those the other two people didn't do anything so i had to go back there so I always train, I keep training, retraining, and I keep showing up myself at trainings. I train so that I can train my leaders. I train myself, I listen, I show up. I show up at every webinar, I show up at seminars, unless they clash. Sometimes I can even open three devices to be part of meetings, and I shuttle between the, the three. You know, so there are rejections, but 
personal development, you, I keep making, getting out a better version of myself so that I can remain relevant in people's lives. Mm. So that I mm. can reduce rejection. When I'm relevant in your life, you find it difficult to reject me. Of course, in the beginning, I had a lot of rejections. Then I had to learn. So I made myself better. I became better, getting better, better skills, better strategy. Wow. Wow. Better communication that's work John no so I do but making myself I often we 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 work on the three KYPs the first KYP is know your products the second KYP is know your prospects so before you offer your Long Beach business you must know, know them know your know products what they mean. know your prospects and then know your partners. Those are the three KYPs we, we, we flow with. Oh. In knowing your partners, oh. even in the team, even in the team, I know who to call when I have a risky project. I don't call everyone. I know people's skills. I, 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 ma I made sure that I understand my partners. I know who is afraid of of um, back back orders, I know who is not afraid of back orders, <laughs> and I flow with them. <laughs> that is it. I know who who, who is afraid. Of. Yeah, so you must know your partners so that you can have a successful journey. And everyone is entitled to their opinions. If you are afraid of back orders, mm. deal with her at that level. It doesn't mean she's a bad person. Mm. It doesn't mean he or she is bad. It doesn't mean that is the level, that level, that's where she can go up to. You deal with her according to, to what she can offer. So those three KYPs have helped us a lot in the business. Know your partners, know your prospects, know your, your, your products. In knowing your prospects, you, you won't offer a man with a fleet of six cars. Don't offer him car promo. That's not what you're going to use to attract him. That's, that's the problem with so many people. Yeah, mm. but, and then it, it might be traveling. It might be, you, you need to know him, know her first. I have people in my team. I met somebody in China when I went for my, for, for the first time to China with Longbridge. Is, she's a widow in Kano. She told me that the reason why she joined Longridge was to travel. She said when her husband was alive, they used to travel a lot, but that she didn't have people to travel with. So somebody like that, if, if she was going to be my prospect, and I keep telling the person that, ah, you're going to, they're going to be paying you bonuses that she has, a, her husband left a lot of money for her. That wasn't her mm. why. That wasn't her why. So you must know your prospects before you offer the opportunity so that you will know which strategy to use. You know which, her, which angle, what to offer her or him. And in knowing your products, you must be able on your toes, tell somebody, give out a solution by knowing your products. If somebody is complaining of something, immediately you must know which products you should offer. So those three things have helped us. It has helped us to organize, organize our business. The three KYPs. Oh. Oh. Did, you, did, you, did you ever have, uh, that, that, that's, that's great. I love this strategy. I, like, I love these uh, ideas you just shared with us. Were there times you had, aside the, Aside the rejection, aside the the time you felt discouraged when you got your first earnings, are they did you have any challenges or okay, you mentioned that your leg, two legs were not working. Yes. And you were able to concentrate there because many people complain that uh, 
their team members are not working because that's the most common challenge uh, complaints I have from people that uh, their team members is not working. So discouraging. Did you ever have such challenges? Oh, yes, yes, yes. But what you do is, um, well, I always say it's like a corporate organization. The chairman mm -hmm. and the three MDs. The chairman has like three companies in his group, group of companies. If an MD is not working, I always ask my team, what do you do? Hmm. not working you do all you can yeah you can fire the md but in long reach you cannot <laughs> you can fire, fire the md the by MD. replacing <laughs> you know why why i will not support total firing is that in four years that md can wake up and i have one like that in my business i had this partner that we started together and in one year she became a diamond four and then she went to sleep. I tried everything to bring her back, but it wasn't working. And suddenly, suddenly, out of the blues, she called me and said she had some money to invest. And this was during this lockdown, during this lockdown. Yes. And from that, she came back, number one, it impressed her that she found her diamond four intact. Her PVs were still there. She left four years ago. She came back in 2020. She still had mm. her diamond four PVs there. And she took up the, the journey again. And today, she invested as a regional stockist in the UK. She's now a diamond six, wow. almost a diamond seven. Wow. What if I had wow. fired her? If I had fired her, fired. Yeah. she wouldn't, yeah. yeah. So I won't say we should fire because somebody wrote in the chat room that That's fire true. the empty. <laughs> you can replace. We replace and just leave her. But while replacing, you let the MD hear your good news. The MD mm. must hear how the company is doing. By you, wow. you just keep sending information. Let us know that you've just won this car. Let her know that you've just built this house. Let her know that you just went on this trip. Result, result we wake them up. Yes, that is it. Success needs speed. <laughs> That's it. That's yeah. it. Success <laughs> will wake them up. So, so yeah. they, they, what, what I've gotten from you now, you, 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 you. That means you recruit new people on that leg. Oh yes, I recruit. I keep recruiting. I replace people like, I mean, if you have to, um, I, I, I call have my- you stopped, you know, Have you I stopped have, recruiting? Me? Why should I? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I will recruit the, a rat in my house before I kill it. A rat. I will do a presentation <laughs> to a rat, sign him on, and then kill him. <laughs> I'm still recruiting. <laughs> this is funny. <laughs> Why should I stop recruiting? Uh, I'm still recruiting. I told you I'm a lover of people. I meet people. Yes. Every, yeah, I meet people every day. I, I make new friends every day. When I'm on a journey, when I'm, I'm in the plane, everyone surrounding me in the plane is in trouble before we get to where we are going. They will sign on. I make friends easily. I love people. Uh, and of wow. course, I've told you, Long Bridge is a lifestyle thing for me. This is what I do in, in, now. This is what I eat. This is what I breathe. This is what I sleep. I wake it. I sleep it. So it's my lifestyle. So it's very important for me not to still keep recruiting because that's all you hear from me. 
Wow. Fantastic. This is this is this is amazing. I, well, I, I guys, are you enjoying this? Drop that. Drop one one in the chat box if you are feeling the way I'm feeling, guys. Drop one one in the chat box. This is this is mind blowing. And <laughs> and and I love what what you, you you just mentioned because that is that is what I tell people. Don't disturb yourself. Some people they have lost relationship because they feel the team members is not working. They quit on them. They oh, destroy no. the relationship. Oh, no. Don't destroy. Don't don't destroy relationship. I said the person is doing another business and start posting it on the group. You can exit them. But for now, allow them to be seeing the results. When they see the results, they will come back. They will come back and start doing. I have I have someone just what you just mentioned. Few weeks ago, someone that wasn't even doing anything in his in a in our business just came up with someone with a stock case. Two weeks ago. So what if I say, hey, you're not working? Go, go, let me flog your head. Leave my group. You've got to be patient. Patient with people because this is a different profession entirely, and you must give them the opportunity to learn the business, to keep learning. Because some of them are they are battling with their why. They are battling with their why. So once the why comes up, you can't hold them again. So thank you very much, Ma, for sharing this journey with us. Now, can you tell us? Uh, I, I know you have mentioned some of the success stories, you you things you've had as a result of burning Long Beach. We want to hear more. What are the what are the trips you qualify for? What are the cars? What are the the number of Team members who have qualified for so many things. Let's hear them now. We'll conclude with that. Um, what I let me tell you what I did in my what what, what um, other dividends I have. My UK home. We have a home in the UK. We have a house. I we used to live in the UK. Now oh. today, UK bonuses my UK bonuses pay for the mortgage of that house where we have a debt-free home. We are living free in the house. In the, in, in, in. You see, I like challenges and I'm an analytical person. I analyze things. If I just thought, I, if this can do this, then it should be able to do that. And I keep mentioning my upline as the show. You see, um, he really gave me the, the courage, yeah. He's a very courageous chap, very courageous. I just tell him, pass some things, pass it through it by him, and I say, I want to try this. Say, mommy, do it. You know, I didn't know that I could do that. I didn't know that our UK home, my husband was almost going to sell the place. Because yeah. now we were in Nigeria and we were changing money to pay for the mortgage. We were changing money, Naira. And then, you know, Naira will fluctuate. Look at now, how much is Naira to pound sterling? Assuming I was paying for that. But now I don't have any headache. My bonuses are paying. My bonuses are dropping there. And there's a direct debit. And I have a house. I can go there anytime. I don't have to, you know, it's, it's a great one. It's key in my, in, my, in my business. Key, that's house payment is key, a key dividend of Longridge. I see the way you are mentioning the key. It shows up how it was, man. Yeah, that's great. it was, <laughs> yeah, we, we were almost going to sell. And you know, if you wow. going back, if you go on holidays, that would have meant going to other people's houses to stay or going to hotels. But now we, we have the house to ourselves. We can go there at any time and it's free, free. Mm. You understand? Mm. And my lifestyle. Oh, I love my lifestyle now. I love my lifestyle. If not for this meeting with you, my SD, I start my day at 12 noon. That's the Mama Pablo way. <laughs> That's yeah, the Pablo at your old way. Age, you know, nobody's pushing you. <laughs> Nobody. I wake up when my body tells me to wake up. 
There's no hurry. Hey, yes. Too much. Wow. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> too much of the chemical, guys. Too much sauce. That is the, <laughs> is the Pablo way. That is the why Pablo I'm way. Pablo. The ah, Pablo hey, way. Wow. <laughs> yeah. I was, I walked when I was supposed to walk. I digged, I digged, I digged that tunnel. And now water is flowing freely. That's the way. This is retirement for me. My lifestyle is another great dividend. I must tell you, this is where I have always wanted to be. I hated waking up to go to work. I Wow, this is mind blowing, guys. Uh, what, what, what our industry, I what our business is doing behind those that not moving. If I come now, I say, God bless you. I love my leaders. I love them. They cut on the vision like fire. Mm. Every, they make up their mind to win cars. They make up their mind they must be on that trip. I don't have figures in my head, but I tell you, you are going to see things come July next year with this new mm. car award. Yes. And I like what they are doing with their teams. I love what that. We have a few Pablos amongst them. We have I'm Mama Pablo. I have Bobo Pablo, I have Sissi Pablo, I have Omoge Pablo. I have them, subsets of Pablos, people that are digging their tunnels now so that they can rest later, so that they can yeah. be at peace and let the money just flow. We don't want, we I, don't want, we don't want Brunos, it's Pablos we want. No, we don't want Brunos. We don't have Brunos <laughs> in my team. We have Pablos, <laughs> you know? <laughs> I it, got the memo so nice. now. <laughs> touching lives. Everybody touches lives. I like the way my team members are touching other lives. Mm. They are touching lives because we got it from our own upline and we are passing it on and they are passing it on. We are touching lives and we are breaking barriers. Sissy wow. Pablo, I see you. Sissy Pablo. <laughs> <laughs> wow. It's very interesting. <laughs> It's cool. Thank, thank you very much, Ma, for this opportunity to hear from you. I'm so, so excited uh, with your kind of person and you've been a friendly Mama Pablo to, to many people and to me. And um, your story, your journey is, be a, is an encouragement to so many people here who are having different mindsets, especially, especially those who are in the corporate world, those who are high profile people who are thinking that this is not a business for them. From your story, they've seen that this is a business they need to go all out for. Look at the lifestyle you just mentioned, the lifestyle. You know, the lifestyle cannot be compared and that is what we are enjoying. You wake up at when you want to wake up, you do your business yeah. and you still get massive results. So yeah. thank you very much for your time. Thank, thank you, you very, very much, much for this opportunity. Thank you for having me. Thank you very much. Ah, I this network didn't make me to see how you are reacting, the pace, where network, maybe we'll have another part, another part to the show. We're going to do it again. So guys, if you got value, if you got value, I want you to hashtag value. I want you to tag the people you think are feeling too big to join this business, tag them. They need to see this and go back to our profile, share the profile to the person and say, let the person see the kind of person we have in our business. And you know, if you are if you are in this business and you are you you are good with where you are coming from, joining network marketing, like I always say, you need to learn what it takes and you need to be coachable. You need to humble yourself, learn what it takes, and you surely have success in this business. Don't feel too big and be broke. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Remember the KP, uh, the KYP. Remember it. Remember it. Have it written somewhere because that's what many of us are missing. 
remember it. So thank you very much for the time. Uh, my regards to the family, my love to the family, and bye-bye. Thank you. Bye. <laughs>